Okay, I gotta do some black cats and some black trays. It's so much easier if I do these all the black stuff at once because it uh, until it gets sealed, it has a tendency to bleed black. So one of the things we talked about in the group this week um, <laughs> is dealing with the super black. It has a tendency to to bleed until it gets sealed. So I like to really do really good seals on the black stuff because yeah, it has a tendency to uh, bleed until it gets sealed. I sold out of black cats. I sold out of a lot of things a couple weeks ago. It was kind of crazy. The market was just so busy. And um, as soon as I was showing stuff to people, they were like picking it up, picking it up, picking it up. So, which is cool. Wrong with that. So these guys are in pretty good shape. So now we got black on black trays. And then I got a black and gold one, and I got some solid black ones. So. Black on black trays I've already sealed once. I'm just gonna really seal them again. I don't need to seal seal them like I sealed them the first time, but I do want did want to seal them again. This is the only sets that I'll let sit for a week after I do uh, three of these. I'll let them sit for a full week. And then I'll come back and I'll seal them again. I just... Let's see, this is the black with the gold swirls. This stuff looks so cool. This is just a solid black tray. I had somebody request those, and it's like, I'll do them. is really overkill on doing sealing but I prefer to uh, overkill on this than to have somebody get black all over their hands or something sealer just gets totally in there. Yeah, we were off last week and first first weekend we've been off since January. So we needed the and the heat. Heat's been a little uh, a little bit of a challenge. It always is here. And uh 
I'll just be back out there starting again this weekend. So we just took a week on Saturday off. And yeah, first week, week. First weekend we were off since January, so. But we like doing this stuff. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. See how shiny they got? They're so cool. Those have already soaked in. This looks so cool. You can tell when they seal really well because the sealer will no longer go in. And I'll just let them air dry. And, uh, I still need to put feet on them. And what I'll do with this sealer is, which is what I did just before I started this video, was to, I'll filter it to try to get some of the, uh, the little garbage out of the, out of the, uh, the sealer and get little particles in the bottoms of these things and that kind of stuff and so I like to filter it every now and then uh, gonna get some of this stuff out totally black these guys came out really good really 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 good That one's ready to go. Let's go ahead and get a little air bubble. So let's do him again. And, you know, I don't do wipe with this stuff. I leave it just sit on. It's good to uh, dry. I never see any like pooling of this stuff at the end. So I do this just to get kind of speeds up my drying a little bit. But overall, you know, these guys look just about ready to go. Once that sealer finishes drying, they'll be ready to go. I put feet on them. Um, so that's it that's it for this bunch i got a bunch more to do and i'm just not gonna video them because i got a bunch more to do so that's it okay bye